Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play Trails in the Sky of the Third Blind. So, I want to have a look at the, the doors that we have or have not done or whatever. See the moon doors first. Bring to me the girl engineered and all blah 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 blah. Yes. Bring to me the dancer. Nope. Bring to me the darling of pure white radiance and proof of her- Oh! Bring to me the darling of pure white radiance and proof of her scholarship. Oh, now it makes sense. Okay, so there's a moon door we could do. Bring to me the guardian of the royal family and the blade that serves in pure hearts. Done that. Those who have not proved themselves in battle. Done that. Bring to me the boy with the eyes of amber and the princess. And, 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 and done that. Yes. Bring to me the man who talks with his fists. I think we have that one also to do. Bring to me the only girl in the band who takes to the skies. Bring to me the girl who loves to fish. Bring to me the fists of steel. Which nothing in this world can move. So there are two Zen ones, I guess. Unless the talking with his fists is a gate. Oh, a gate! We don't have a gate either! Oh my god. Um, alright. Let's not save. What was I gonna do? Uh, oh, I was actually gonna look at this. I wanted to look at the... This? Nope. This. Um. What's that noise? Let us sleep with our eyes open. It's great. Uh, our moon doors are long. Star doors are short. Sun doors are mini games. Okay, let's go do the moon door. Da, 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 I didn't mean to click on this. Actually, rip. Hold on. Just kidding. It's not ready to go. Um, this one. Oh, I'm gonna need Chloe. <laughs> I don't have Chloe in my party. Who do you think I am? Oh, I have to go back though. <laughs> I keep forgetting you can only change your party when you're in the base thing. I just keep forgetting about it. <sighs> okay. Chloe. Alright. Hopefully I don't have to fight with you. Or we're gonna have some problems. <laughs> okay. Moon door. Alright. Now I understand why we got that item. Ah, it makes all the sense. I bet there are lots of people telling me in that, in the last video. But this is the same day, so I have not seen your comments. <laughs> <clears throat> Bring to me the darling of pure white radiance and proof of her scholarship. Assuming this is her. Only then shall the door open. Open the door. Open the door. See, he flees the kingdom. Moon chamber. <laughs> ow, ow, ow. Can I not have a cramp in my neck, please? That'd be great. I shall grant to you a memory fragment and my blessing. And then turn you upside down. Don't worry, it's totally normal. Spring came. But it took far more time doing so than the average year. Because of climate change and now we're going to have a chapter about it one by one the magnolia flowers began to show their faces to the world as if reluctant to let their long slumber end and with the changing of the seasons a brand new student of the infamous jenny's royal academy set foot into its grounds slightly later than her peers oh so she's going to be younger i guess Well, here I am. Transfer student? Transfer from where? <sighs> I don't know. What was that? That wasn't a Brit. Okay, whatever. Okay, I can do this. Ba -ba -da -ba -ba -da -ba. Ba -da 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 I'm getting like anxious. Oh, who's that? Oh. Uh -huh. Who's that? Who is that? 
yeah, I'm like getting anxious <laughs> because like this place, there's so much in this place. So like, if I have to go around and talk to everybody, <laughs> so that's our famous transfer student, huh? I see. A hawk? Nah, seems more like a falcon. I like how you're just lying there. On on the roof. Like, how do you even get on the roof? I'd sworn to myself that I would stop relying on other people. I'd had enough of being instructed in how to live. I'd had enough of following the rails laid out for me by other people. I was going to put my own two feet on the ground and start living my own life by myself. That was my resolve, and I intended to abide by it. But somewhere in my heart, I had already realized that resolve of mine was nothing more than an excuse. Oh? Uh, social studies classroom, first year, joint class. Settle down, settle down. I've got someone to introduce to you all. This is our new transfer student, Chloe Rins. She's going to be studying... Oh, so oh, maybe when they say transfer student, they mean somebody coming from another school rather than like from another town or whatever. Okay. She's going to be studying, oh, social studies, apparently. You'll be with me then. Well, why else would I be here? Well, why don't you introduce yourself to the class? Of course. What's that on the wall? Weird. My name is Chloe Rins, and starting today, I will be a first year student at this academy. I've been looking forward to beginning my life at this wonderful academy for some time, so I'm truly delighted to be here. It's an honor to be able to count myself among your number. I'm still- <laughs> the way she's talking. I'm still an inexperienced child in many ways, so I fear I may cause you all trouble in the coming days and weeks. But I intend to work as hard as I can for the betterment of myself, my class, and my school. So I do hope we can all get along. It's like this like massive speech she's giving. Oh, people are clapping. I Oh, I thought they'd be weirded out by it. I sure wasn't expecting a transfer student at this time of year. I wonder if she's from a rich family or something. She sure sounds stuffy, so it would fit. There you go, there it is. She's obviously got some kind of special circumstances to be enrolling in May. Excuse me, but could I ask a question? Where do you live? You're from Libel, right? Uh, yes, I'm from Grandsell. Do you have any hobbies? Uh, not especially. What, for reals? That's kind of boring. Uh, still, no matter how much I think about it, nothing comes to mind. I suppose I could say making sweets, but I don't feel like I do that enough for it to qualify as a hobby. Isn't the entrance exam for student transfer students supposed to be crazy hard? You must be really smart to be able to pass it. Harder than the one the rest of us took? No way, that was nuts as it was. You must be quite smart. Uh, um... Okay class, that's enough. I'm sure you must all have things you want to ask our new student, but they can wait until after class. Go and take a seat, Chloe. Oh, yes ma'am. Alright then, time to get started with our lesson. If you would, open your textbooks to page 23. Hmm, the mysterious transfer student. Now there's a surefire recipe for catching my interest. Hmm. Bum, 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 bum. Two weeks passed at the academy. Despite the passing of time, the student's interest in the transfer student showed no sign of... Oh, hello, Naru. Showed no sign of letting up. And she was soon the talk of the whole school. What are you doing? <laughs> hello. You lying here. All anyone wanted to talk about was her. How smart- Oh, this isn't her! Wait, I'm confused, but okay. All anyone wanted to talk about was her. How smart she was, how unusually polite she was, among other things. Her peers thought the formalities were largely due to nurse and that she would naturally ease up over time, but the reality was somewhat different. Poor big stretches, not a So put him in the head with your tail, please. Phew, I'm glad that's over. Oh, it's Anton, that's funny. Phew, glad I attended class today. We ended up covering so much. Come on, Monica, it's time for practice. Coming! Hello? 
Oh dear, did everyone go home already? I haven't handed out all these printouts yet. Oh, it's Miss Wiola. She looks like she needs help with something. Maybe I could volunteer. No time like the present. Uh, um, Miss Wiola, is there anything I can help you with? You seem rather troubled about something. Well, there is, but I'd feel a little bad asking you to help me with it. Hmm. Well, if you insist. Uh, of course. Ms. Wheeler handed a pile of printouts to Chloe. Could you go and hand these out to all of the social studies students then? One each. They're rather important too, so try and see that everyone gets one. I'll get to work right away. Thank you so much. Okay, gotta run. There's a staff meeting starting soon. Let's see. Oh, this is a list of the year's credits. No wonder she wanted these handed out right away. They couldn't wait till tomorrow. I might as well start with the students still here. After that, I can go and speak with the ones who have gone to their respective clubs, as well as those who have returned to their dormitories. Okay, to work I go. And now we walk around. Somebody left their thing on the desk here. Yeah, this thing. Oh, it's a light! Oh, it's a light. From where, uh, like, from here, it looks like it's all flat against the wall. I was like, is the light switch exploding in another plane or something? Like, I don't even... Okay, hello. Really? I had no idea. Well, the Republic is pretty huge in terms of landmass and all. Just traveling on foot isn't going to cut it. You need a more effective means of transportation. Uh, excuse me. Oh, Chloe, hello. Can we help you something? Well, you see, Miss Miss Wheeler has entrusted me with the task of giving printouts to all the social studies students. Chloe gave Roy and Thelma a copy of the printout each. Hey, it's a list of all our credits. Thanks for going out of your way to deliver these, Chloe. Not at all. I apologize for intruding on your conversation, too. I'll get out of your way now. Have a good day. Uh-oh. <laughs> Uh-oh. Right. Uh-oh. Duh. Crazy how polite she is, huh? Yeah, I guess. She's a bit too polite, though, if you ask me. Makes it hard to feel comfortable talking to her. <laughs> yeah, I get that. I get that. Yeah. Yeah. It is really kind of awkward when people talk to you like that. Or, like, instead of kind of, like, excusing themselves from a conversation in a natural way, like, like, just leaving, or... Um, just saying they have to go, or, like, just, you know, leaving, you know? Like, they're like, oh, I've taken up enough of your time already, and I don't want to bore you any further, so I'm going to leave now, you know? But there, there are people that talk like that, and it's just, like, it's really awkward. It's like, you don't have to, you don't have to, do, it's like, I'm sure you mean well, and stuff, and I don't think they're, you know, whatever. It's just, it's, it's, kind of, it's just like, oh, you don't have to be so worrying that you're being annoying or something, you know? So like, just shh, relax, it's okay. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> Excuse me. You aren't a social studies student, are you? Sorry, but no. By the way, I have some very close friends who talk like that. So it's not that I dislike people who talk like that or anything. It's just, it's, I just wish people could relax a little. <laughs> Sorry, but no, I'm a natural sciences student, actually. Oh. oh, oops. Uh, I see. S sorry for troubling you then. <laughs> That's awkward. Quiet in the hall, student council. I, I am not trying to talk to that. Thank you. It's almost time for our club to decide on a new captain. Personally, I'm backing Felicity, naturally, but she doesn't seem to have any interest in the position, unfortunately. I'm not going to let that stop me, though. I'm sure I can think of something to change your mind. Pup, 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 pup. Natural sciences classroom. In my experience, Leo's observations are always worth keeping a close eye on. I can't believe he was able to work out the properties of this material from so little data. But that's just what he does. Lado, what are you doing? Hello, gorgeous. He didn't rely on guesswork either. His evidence for his beliefs is sound too. I really do look up to him. Ba 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 ba. Ba ba ba. Ba da 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 da. Hello. <clears throat> oh, Chloe. 
How are you doing? Have you settled in here yet? Well, I'd like to think so, yes. By the way, thank you very much for your help during the enrollment process. Thanks to you, I was able to begin my new life here without any problems at all. I'm just glad to have been of assistance. If there's anything else you need help with, you need only to ask. I'll do what I can. I'll bear that in mind. Thank you very much. Da, da. A meeting is going on in the faculty lounge. I should probably keep away to avoid disturbing them. I guess so. Oh, hello. Oh, hello there, Chloe. Are you finally starting to get used to life here? Sir, uh, I want to thank you again for permitting me to transfer here on such short notice. I really... Chloe, you undertook our official transfer student exam and you passed it. You needn't feel at all indebted to me or feel as though you're being granted special treatment. I... if you say so, sir, thank you. That's awkward as fuck. Hello. Humanities classroom, nobody in here. And that's the way out. Okay, I have to try to think. Directions. <laughs> da -da -da -da, there are too many ways. Oh, I can leave? Why can I go over here? I am surprised that I can go over here. Oh, hello. Okay. I guess I had to come over here. Hey, Ricky. Why are we here? Spring has come, and yet in my heart, it's still the middle of winter. Uh, why does everything in my life have to go wrong? Uh, excuse me. Oh, I know you. You're the transfer student, right? Uh, I wish I was smart like you. Uh, um, Ms. Riola told me to deliver this to you. Chloe handed Anton a printout. Uh, I shouldn't even need this. I should have. He's sighing so much. I should have graduated, but here I am redoing the year again. Oh, that's really awkward. What? Can't believe I have to do my third year all over again. This is the worst. I was so full of hope when I first enrolled here, and look at me now. I don't think in New Zealand they can hold you back a year. I don't think that's a thing that happens at our schools. But I don't... I don't know if anyone's ever not passed their final exam... Z ...and stuff. So I don't know. I mean, I guess they have, but... I don't know. Anyway, uh, yeah. Uh, um, I'm not sure what to say in this situation. Like, I don't know how that works, actually. Hey there, you look like you're in a hurry. Oh, you're looking for social studies students? There's one standing right here, Anton. Personally, I think he made a major mistake picking that course in the first place, though. He's not built for that, all that work. Da -da -da. The door is locked. Is there any point to being around here? Probably not. Hey! It's like... Oh, no, mind. I was gonna say it's not all broken and stuff, but it is. Just kidding. Da -da -da. I'm, I'm glad there was something this way. Or, like, I'm glad I went this way. I was expecting it to not let me. Like, that she would be like, Oh, I don't think there's anyone that way. I should turn around. Or something. But, no? Uh, I, yeah, it probably would have taken me ages to find them, so... Oh, hello. Lots of people in here. <sighs> Ideas help us. Where is that loser? I would have thought we'd have found him by now. Luce, Lucy! I'm not sure I can... Oh, Lucy! I'm not sure I can stand much more of this. Stop your whining, you. I bet you've secretly been slacking off with your search the whole time, haven't you? I have not. I just don't get it. We're swimming in eyewitness reports of him, but us running into him? It's not happening. Why? I don't think our odds of capturing him today are especially high, Leo. What should we do? I suppose we'll just have to do what we can without him for now. The two of us can handle the majority of the student council's work, but we are going to need his approval in the end. So, oh, this must be the guy on the roof they're talking about. So you two need to keep up your search. Find him as soon as possible. It is so cold. Right now, by the way, it feels like I have a window open. I was gonna say door. It feels like I have a window open, even though I don't have a window open. It's 48 degrees at the moment. In Fahrenheit. Dun da 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 dun. Oh, 8 degrees in Celsius. Okay. <clears throat> um. Blah, blah, blah. Right. Right. Ba -da -ba -da -da. I'll see you two later. Righto. Oh, you like her, huh? 
da, 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 da. Well, I guess we better get back to work. <sighs> we must. Huh? Chloe? What brings you here with a pile of printouts in hand? Oh, uh, well... I'm just helping Miss Wheel over some of her work, you see. By going around after classes giving out printouts? You're a model student. I, will, I would have turned her down if I was in your position. Uh, well, how about this? Why don't we give you a hand with it? Two of us are going to be walking around the school for a while because of some other work anyway, so it'll be no skin of our backs. Oh, that's a horrible image, but um, I don't want to trouble you. I was the one who accepted this task, so it's my duty to see it through to the end. Well, if you excuse me, I should probably be getting back to it. Good luck with your work. Your own work. Oh, rip. They were trying so hard to, like, be friends with you, and you're just like... You just, like, brush them off. <laughs> oh, that's awkward. Rip. So, like... She probably doesn't know how to make friends, though. Guess who's sharing a room with her? Me. <laughs> Huh? Really? She's supposed to be a real genius from all I've heard about her. Sounds like one convenient room arrangement if you ever find yourself stuck on homework. Well, I guess you could say it that way. But it's like, I don't know. She's really pleasant and polite and all, but sorta... Of, it's like she doesn't want to be super close to anybody. Yeah, I get what you mean. Naru? Oh my god, Naru? Can you stop, please? What are you doing? I gave you food! Stop being annoying! Yeah, I get what you mean. But if you're sharing a room with her, you can't be total strangers, right? Don't you talk sometimes? Not really. Hi and good night is about the most we do, to be honest. I wish I could talk to her normally. Aww. Is there anything in here? No, there isn't. Boys locker room. That's awkward. I don't really want to be in here. <sighs> Looks like someone's getting changed. I should come back later. Uh, okay. Apparently changing. Uh, okay. Uh, okay. If you happen to encounter the student council president, inform us at once. Uh, okay. Oh, are you the new transfer student? Student? Y yes, that's right. Um, I. I take it this is your first time coming to the room? To this room? There's no need to be so nervous. I'm the student council's vice president, Lucy Sayland. He's our secretary and accountant, Leo. He doesn't have a last name. It's a pleasure to meet you. You're very welcome to come here whenever you like. Uh, she's so pretty. Oh! oh. Uh, my name is Chloe Lins. It's nice to meet you. The pleasure is all mine. Your academic life here probably isn't going to be all smooth sailing, but I'm sure you'll be fine. Just try and enjoy yourself. I believe in you. Th thank you. Oh, was that was that some kind of like meet cute or something? <laughs> uh, oh, they're gone. Hello. Oh, I don't think I've seen you here before. Are you a first year? This is the school cafeteria. When you want something to eat, you come right here. Kids your age always have ravenous appetites, so if you want something to eat, don't feel bad about it. Come right along here. Blah, 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 blah. Okay. Doo doo. Doo doo. Bam, bam. Oh, hey, Chloe. You're sure you don't need any help with that? Really, really sure? I'm sure. I promise all these would be delivered no problem, so don't you worry about me. Well, if you're sure. If you change your mind, though, just come let me know. It'll be no sweat on my end. Do you just say the word? That's really annoying. I mean, that Chloe's not accepting her help. Ah! Oh, that's probably what I would do. It's not the point. Stop that. Hmm. I know you. Well, it ends, wasn't it? Do you have some business with me? Well, not personally, no. I've been entrusted with the task of giving a printout to you by Ms. Viola. Chloe handed Logic a printout. I thought they said Parrot. Oh, this is all list of this year's credits. <laughs> what? What? Joint classes seem to be worth an awful lot while we're first years. Wait, physical education is worth five whole credits? Ideals, help me. Um, I suppose I should probably leave him alone for a while. Well, if you'll excuse me. Well, wait a moment. Y yes Oh, no. It's just that according to this printout, examinations will be taking place in six weeks' time. Make sure you study thoroughly for them. 
I don't want to hear any excuses if you don't strive for the top. Oh. Uh. Uh. Okay. A absolutely. I'll devote myself fully to my studies. That was... Awkward. The kind senior student has agreed to lend me some reference books to aid me in my studies. He's in the process of choosing some fitting ones for me this very moment, I believe. I have no intention of not delivering to my full potential during the examinations, and I hope you feel the same way. Make sure you study thoroughly for them. Oh, he had so much more to say than I expected. I'll just, like, hang out in the boys' dorms. Totally fine. It's totally fine that I'm here. Ba -da 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 -da. Logic asked if he could borrow some of my reference books, so I'm in the process of choosing ones to give him. He really is alarmingly dedicated to his studies. <laughs> That's no bad thing, though. On the contrary, I think it's great. I've got no reason to be going out of the grounds right now. I can't imagine any of the students I'm looking for have left. That's what I was expecting at the other gate. I can't turn the camera around. Oh, yes I can. Oh, I just can't use the stick. That's weird, because usually I can use the stick. Uh, huh. Guess I need to set up my controller again. <gasps> oh, hello. Lucy sure is gorgeous, isn't she? She's here as an exchange student from the Principality of Remiferia to the north. I wonder if all the girls there are as pretty. I sure wish I was. Beauty is in the eye of the beholder, though, as they say. Plus, you look pretty, quite pretty yourself, so. You're that new student, right? What are you doing hanging outside the girls' dorm? What do you want? I'm not really in the mood to talk. This is the girls' dorm, isn't it? Or is it the, the gym? Oh, it's the gym, just kidding. Oh, sorry, the auditorium. We call it a gym in New Zealand. Actually, well, it depends. Because, you know, if it's a gym, then it's a gym, but I guess you can also call it a hall. You can call it a hall as well. Oh, I recognize you. It depends, though, if you do actual, if you actually bring out gym equipment and do gym stuff there. But often a gym in a New Zealand school used to be the hall back in the day when the school was old and then they change it into a gym. Anyway, you're the new first year transfer student. Claire, you're in, correct? At least that's what it was like in my school. Yes, I am. I'm Regil, a third-year humanities student. I also serve as the captain of the fencing club. If you are at all interested in what we do at fencing club, that's funny. You'll be welcome to stay and watch us practice. I wish I could, but I'm afraid I'm a little too busy at the moment. Thank you for your offer, though. Ah, oh, so polite! Oh, stop it, it's so... Ah, drives me crazy. Hmm. It, it just, it's so, like, jarring when somebody uses the wrong level of formality in a situation, especially... I mean, I don't mean to be all like, oh, I have a master's in linguistics, but especially because I've studied linguistics, so it's just like, it's even, it's just, I mean, like, it's already jarring for people in general, but like, because I've studied this stuff, it's just like, ah, stop it! Hmm. <laughs> just the thought, it's, I, I think I'm more sensitive to it because of that, but just the thought of joining reminds me of my training sessions with Julia. And then there's also the New Zealand thing on top of it. New Zealand, we're like, we're very... We had this tall poppy syndrome thing, so it's like if somebody acts super like formal and stuff, it's kind of like, who do you think you are? Like, oh, you think you're so much better than us? Like, 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 just like, just relax and like talk like the rest of us, you know? Like, it's, yeah, we're very equalitarian there. Anyway, <clears throat> just the thought of joining reminds me of my train station, Julia. Da -da 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 -da. Oh, hello. Is that you, Monica? Finally, we've been waiting for you, you know. No, it's just me. Ha 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 ha. That's awkward. Uh, I... I... Sorry, I don't mean to confuse you. What? You didn't do anything wrong. I was the one who made a mistake. Oh yeah, and there's that as well. When people like say sorry for things that they shouldn't be sorry for, and it's like, why are you saying sorry? And then they'll be like, sorry, and I'm like, ah! <laughs> <laughs> ah. <clears throat> sorry, I'm okay. <clears throat> oh, I suppose you're right. Uh, I'm sorry. Stop it! Chloe! Like I said, I was the one who made a mistake. Can we stop this? Okay, thank you. Thank you. Stop right there. Don't mind her, Chloe. She's kind of slow on the uptake at times like these. 
Did you need something from us, though? We're gonna start practice soon, so we can't hang around and talk long. Oh, I see. Oh, I'm so sorry. Oh, 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 oh. Still, I'm relatively sure that Clara is a social studies student. It doesn't really seem like the best time to be intruding on them. Maybe it would be best for me to excuse myself now and come back later. Uh. Oh, I know. You came to watch us practice because you're thinking of joining the club, right? Awesome. Why can't she just fucking give them the thing? Chloe, you're so infuriating right now. Just give it to them. He would be stoked to have you as a member. You already interrupted them. So now just say, like, I'm here with the paper. And then instead of just being like, I'm just standing here and I don't know if I should give you the thing or what should happen right now. This is still driving me crazy. <laughs> you might want to let her speak before bu uh, busting out the confetti and streamers. Seriously, just ignore it, Chloe. If you don't, we'll be here all day. We really do need to start soon, though, so can you make whatever you need quick? Oh, sure, sorry. Uh, well, I just came to deliver this, that's all. She gets to have this voice now, because she's being so annoying. Chloe handed Clara the printout. Oh, this is all you're here for? A credits list? I got my hopes up for nothing. Boo. Uh, I'm sorry about that. But yes, this was all I wanted, so I'll let you go ahead and start practice. Uh, oh, thanks. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> I love how much she's scared to say uh oh. It's beautiful. She's kind of weird, right? She's the mysterious transfer student everyone is talking about. You wouldn't expect her to be too normal. Oh, that's her, huh? What? You were in that class with... You're a social studies student. You were there. Oh my god. I wish she'd stayed and joined the club. I mean, I know I have a guppy memory, but it's not as bad as hers. Holy cow, oh, this is pretty. Oh my god. <sighs> what is this? Is this the girl's dorm? No, it's not. Oh, this is the... Okay. The schoolhouse. Sure. The schoolhouse? The school... Where's the girl's dorm? Oh, that, that's where I was. In there. Ah. Oh. Did I... Oh, here's one. Here's a person, I mean. Mr. Effort. You can't see my face right now, but... What? It's about this time of year that the new first year students start getting used to life at the academy. Which means that a lot of them start slacking off because they think they've got it all figured out. And I'm not gonna let that happen this year. No siree! Oh, this is a... That was a uh, teacher. I thought it was a student. I was sort of confused by their name. So am I trying to find this guy now? Is that what's happening? Oh, what was that? Uh, oh, it's you, Chloe. You haven't seen a really slovenly looking guy around here, have you? A slovenly looking guy? That's a no then. Trust me. If you'd seen the guy I'm looking for, you wouldn't need to ask for clarification. Where could he be? If he's not around here, then... Oh. Okay. Bum, ba, da, bum. Did, you, did you have more to say? He's such a nightmare. That guy just loves toying with us. It's really annoying not being able to use the stick to change the camera. I have to do it old school. Oh, hey Chloe. You sure you don't need any help? Blah, 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 blah. Blah 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 And I like how the the L1 and R1 buttons like turn the camera the wrong way as well. It's great. It's really it's great. Let's see if we can find this guy that everyone's looking for. I don't know where he would be though. Ba -da 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 -da. Well, he was up on the roof before, but I don't know how to get up there. <laughs> I don't think I can get up there somehow. Da -da -da. Ba -da 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 -da. Okay, I can't find anyone, so... I am actually not sure where to go right now. Bum, 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 bum. I actually saw the current student council president here not, too, not, not long ago. <laughs> he was so mature for someone his age. Not long ago. Or maybe he's in the social studies room. Nope. That is a no. Da da da. Ba da 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 da. Oh, hello. Next month's schedule is all ready to go. I'll write it up here, so make sure you'll come and check it. Got it? Sure. Was this person here before and I just missed them? 
But it, it, oh, the faculty lounge is open now. What's wrong with the schedule anyway? Looks great to me. Who seems very busy? Mr. Ratio. You want me to be the music club's advisor? Well, I've certainly got no problem with that, but I know next to nothing about music and instruments. Hey, Chloe. I said I wanted to join the Academy's music club, but guess what? Turns out that the club doesn't have any members. In fact, it hasn't since last year. So I have to rebuild it from scratch. That's why I'm here talking to Mr. Ratio. That is fascinating. Thank you for the information. Ba -da -da -da. I don't believe you've been given a full tour of the Academy facilities yet, come to think of it. If there's anything I need explaining to you, I'm sure. Be sure to ask the student council. I'm sure they will only be too happy to help. Thank you, sir. I will bear that in mind. Student council rooms on the second floor of the clubhouse. If there's anything you need help with, I'm sure they'll be glad to see you. Da 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 da. Let's go back here. Hello. Hey there, you looking for someone? Actually, there was a girl who came to talk to me not long ago because she lost something. You're not looking for her, are you? She went up the stairs if you are. Da 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 Wait. Where could it have gone? Oh, there it is. Phew. Uh, excuse me. Hey, you're the transfer student, right? Chloe? Do you need something from me? Yes, actually. You see, Miss, Miss Viola... Viola asked me to deliver these. Chloe handed Monica a printout. Oh, it's our credit list. Ugh, there's so many classes here. Being a second year seems like it's gonna be rough. I'm surprised you went out of your way to deliver these. Not like there was any rush. Yeah, I agree. Um, you really think so? Yeah, she forgot to hand them out last year too. We got them eventually, but it was like forever after we should have. She might be pretty, but she's kind of not all there, if you know what I mean. But that, that's a great quality in a teacher. You might want to watch your back, okay? Like, you're obviously a nice girl, so if you don't, she might end up taking advantage of that. Oh, rip. There you are, Monica. You do realize we can't start without you, right? Whoop, sorry, I'm coming now. Well, I'll see you later, Chloe. Thanks for delivering that printout to me. Oh, not at all. Da 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 da. Ba da da. But, but I need to keep doing what I can. Oh. Maybe I was desperate to cling on to something to keep from losing sight of myself. The world made it seem like you could only broaden your horizons by interacting with others. But there I was, stubbornly refusing to come out of my shell. Or was it really stubbornness? In some weird way I can't explain, it was more like obsessing over the idea that I could grow as long as I pushed myself. It's not like I wanted to be left behind. It's not like I wanted to be alone. As long as I tried hard enough, Maybe I'd one day stop feeling like I was always running in place. Oh, I know that feeling, actually. Do, 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 do. Ba -da -da -da. Huh, hold on a minute. Da -da, da -da 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 -da. I don't have the printout there for me. I wonder if I left mine in the classroom. I must have. I better go back and get it. Da, 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 da. Couldn't you just use thingamajigs? That's like, oh, that's what that was. That was your thing. There it is. I don't know how it got over there. Ah. <sighs> dun, 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 dun. Hey, is that a map of the world? Of this world over there? Mm. Can I really keep going on like this? So yeah, that transfer student came by earlier. Oh, a super smart one? Yeah, anyway. So yeah. Uh, um... I should hurry back to my room and go over what we learned in class. I need to go over our credits list again, too. That was weird. It's like she had an impure thought or something. <laughs> I have to go study so I don't think impure thoughts. <sighs> I'm feeling kind of tired. Uh-oh. 
So much sighing in this door. Hey there, pretty lady. Who is this person? Uh, you're the student council president, right? Bingo, name's Lecter. Sure is a gorgeous sunset today, huh? Oh, y yes it is. So, what are your impressions of the academy? Well, um, I think it's a wonderful place. It's well equipped in terms of facilities, for one thing. And it's everything needed to really cultivate a good environment for learning, and I'm happy to have chosen it. <laughs> uh, my hunch was right on the money. I knew you'd take it that way. As opposed to... Uh, I'm sorry, did I misunderstand you? Well, it was more about... Uh, I was more asking about your life at the academy outside of all the book junk. Maybe it's just me, but you don't really seem to be letting loose or having fun. Uh, um, w well, I do still feel as though I'm still adjusting to life here, so there's a lot that I have yet to learn. But I'll keep working as hard as I can on doing so, I promise. Hmm. Is that really what you came here to do, though? Pardon me? <laughs> Man, you're too serious. Have you ever tried playing hooky? Like ever? At least once? I... Uh... I... I... Oh, okay. Is your back okay? I might not look the part, but I am the student council president, you know? That works pretty damn easy, too. What do you think? Are you inviting me to join? Only if you have a tiny... Uh, only, only if you have a thing for a long nights filled with exciting paperwork and super duper enthralling schedules. Oh, sorry. Uh, only if you have a thing for a long nights filled with exciting paperwork and super duper enthralling schedules. I don't think it's said in a monotone. I think it's said sarcastically. But anyway, okay. Oh, I was hoping for some kind of reaction. If he's the president, there must be something respectful about him. Respectable about him. But I'm not seeing it. How do I put this? I feel like I couldn't trust him as so much as a ten meter coin. Oh, whoops. After Milia was bugging me about showing up for lessons once in a while, I should probably cough up some new excuse to ditch. I mean, I could go. Well, where's the fun in that? Pissing her off's like watching a pot boil over there, so whatever crap I make up better be really convincing. Yep, I think my instincts were dead on. Uh, I I should really be heading back to the dormitory now. You might want to watch how you stand when I'm kicking it down here. Oh! <laughs> my view's awesome, if you catch my drift. Oh my god! Excuse me! That way is the boys' dorm. <laughs> oh, rip. Oh, rip. Oh, boy. This one's gonna be like pulling teeth. Rip. Why does this feel so familiar? Hmm. Several days later, after classes. The Student Council, an autonomous body run by students for students responsible for maintaining order and overseeing student activities. And their most important duty of all is searching for their president. He's not here either. Where is that ruffian? I was sure he'd think he got us he got us and come back to the council room this time, sure of it. I swear, every time we do manage to find him, he gets a thousand times more capable of hiding hiding from us. Where could he be? We've searched the school build we have searched the school buildings, we've searched the dorms. Where's left? The shrubs on the grounds? Ugh, he's just taunting us now. Get it to yeah, it's like a really small place. Get it to get it, Hans. We're gonna find him. And we're gonna force feed him every single piece of paperwork he's got piling up. Right on. Da -da. He reminds me of someone. <clears throat> huh, Chloe? What are you doing sitting there? Oh, hello. I just had a little free time, so I thought I would try and use it productively. Is that lesson prep work? Man, you're so dedicated. I think I can see how you're able to pass a legendary transfer student entr entr entrance exam. Uh, um, it's really just something to pass the time. It's not like I'm working every waking hour of the day. Oh yeah, I guess it wouldn't hurt to ask. You haven't seen Lecter around, have you? 
Lecter? Oh. Uh, I'm almost scared to ask, but he didn't try anything funny on you, did he? No. Sort of. I I'm so, so sorry. This is all our fault for not keeping that nut job on a leash. I don't know how we can begin to apologize to you. Whatever he did will be absolutely sure it never happens again, or anything else of that matter, so please forgive us. We're begging you. Uh, 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 it, it's okay, honestly. You really didn't do anything major to me, honest. R really? Y yes. He just tried to tease me a little. It was harmless fun. Phew, he nearly gave me a heart attack, Chloe. I thought I was gonna faint or something. Seriously, it's getting to the point where I feel like I need to apologize every time I hear his name. Thank Ideos. Thank Ideos. <laughs> um. Is he really that much of a troublemaker? Oh, a troublemaker? That's cute. Honestly, with the personality like that, he's a walking nightmare straight from Gehenna. We've lost count. We've lost count of how many times he's ran away from doing his council work in the past couple of weeks alone. Which would be bad enough if it weren't for the fact that he's usually out, out raising hell for people instead. So instead of doing our own work, we're either out searching for him or apologizing for things he's done. That's why the council's most important policy is, if he's not in our sights, the sooner we find him, the better. If you're thinking we can't be in a, a very effective student council like that, well, you're right. Uh, I see. Something wrong, Chloe? Oh, uh, 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 no, nothing really. But speaking of Lecter, he was sleeping on top of the clubhouse roof not longer. He was? Well, that explains why we couldn't find him. We didn't check there. We didn't check there. You're the best, Chloe. Thanks a ton. N not at all. It was actually Seek who noticed him there, but I suppose I shouldn't tell them that. Huh. <laughs> Come on, Hans. We've got some trash to bring in. Damn straight. Seriously. Thanks. Uh, thanks, Chloe. We owe you big time. See you later. Uh, oh, sh sure. Ba -da 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 um, but um, so that's what he's usually like. My instincts about him being irresponsible were right, I see. Still, that question he asked me. Was that really what you came here to do, though? Ba -da, ba -da, ba -da 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 There he is. Oh. Uh, what? Where is he? He was there a second ago. I saw him. Then why isn't he there now? Crap. Where'd he go? Oh. Oh. Da -da -da -da. Looks like Chloe's heading off somewhere else. Maybe we should ask her again if she saw anything. Huh? Oh, sure, I guess. Can't hurt. I mean, she was the one who led us up here in the first place. She'd probably be a useful asset in our search in general if we could convince her to help. Yeah, let's go down and talk to her. <laughs> Chloe, our favorite person. Oh, hello again. Was she not on the roof? No, no, he was. He just managed to disappear before we could bring our hands around his stupid neck. Can't believe he managed to escape again. That doesn't make any sense to us, though. It's not like there was anywhere to hide up there, and he was way too far up to be able to just jump down. That does seem strange. So, you know... We were wondering if you might have some idea where he might have gone next. And... It doesn't even need to be a specific location like last time. Anything useful you might have on him to share, share away. Please, anything will do. W well, surely he would at some point go back to the boys' dormitory and they could okay, find him there. No, you do seem to need some help. I might have some kind of idea. Wait, you do know something? I don't, but I know someone who might. Let me ask him for you. Seek? Whoa! You have a falcon? Is he your pet or something? Oh, no. He's more like a friend. 
Scurry! Uh, <laughs> gotcha. See, you haven't seen Lecter, have you? He was that slovenly boy who was sleeping on the clubhouse roof not long ago. Scree? Scree, scree, scree. So you lost sight of him? Scree, scree. No, it's alright, don't worry about it. Sorry for calling you then. Thanks for crying, trying to help. Crying to help. Scree. No, I seek. Oh, love you, seek. I don't know what that noise was that I just made, but injured my mouth a little. Wow. He really must be fast as Seek can't keep up with him. Uh, I think we're a bit too busy having our minds blown by you talking to a falcon to feel impressed by Lecter right now. <laughs> yeah, you're telling me. You're a true enigma. D did I do something strange? Oh, don't get me wrong. I don't mean that in a bad way. I'm just genuinely amazed. That makes two of us. Shame that superpower of yours didn't get us any closer to finding Lecter. Indeed. Still... If C couldn't find him, it could mean he's inside one of the buildings. Probably one that's relatively quiet at this time of the day. Actually, that helps narrow things down a lot. It just leaves empty classrooms, the dorms, the auditorium, the old schoolhouse. That still leaves plenty of place if you ask me. Uh, um, would, would you like me to help you? Really? You're sure you wouldn't mind? I thought you had something else you needed to do. I was just going to go and have a look around some of the clubs, but I can do that anytime. Well, I do feel kind of bad about asking you to put yourself out for us. But you really would be a serious help. I don't think we could wish for better, even. You're totally sure, though? We wouldn't want to force you. Of course. Great, let's get to work, then. He's not going to know what hit him. He's not going to know what hit him. I'm guessing he's over here. Oh, we're actually in a party together. That's funny. Dada, I'm just going to save. And I'm going to stop this episode here? And we will continue looking for him next time on Sir Trails in the Sky the Third Blind. Bye-bye.